All right, listen, we are so thrilled once again that we welcome in Katie Morse this morning with the latest 7 Eyewitness News headlines. Katie, how are you? I'm doing well. Feeling I'm okay? Nice. I am. I'm feeling great. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. How about some headlines? How about some headlines? Well, I want to start by letting everybody know today we know what time the governor's speaking. Oh. He's going to be speaking today at 11 o'clock. Okay. So if you're interested in getting that update, which he's been giving to us every day, we'll be carrying it live for you here on air at 11 o'clock. Also on our Facebook and online as well if you have to be moving away from your television. So we'll start with some positive news. California is sending 500 ventilators to New York State and other states have also agreed to do the same. Washington and Oregon are also sending ventilators our way. Again, we're being hit so hard that some of these states are sharing some of their resources here. We also know that rapid testing is now available in Erie County. It's not available to the public quite yet, but different healthcare facilities are doing it. And what they're hoping is that it can help health leaders come up with a more proactive plan. If they get more accurate numbers and more test results, they'll be able to come up with a better plan for our area. Of course, we know maintaining social distancing is still the number one priority here. As far as numbers go in Erie County, we have more than 1,100 confirmed cases. We do know 30 people have died, but 223 have recovered. So we are seeing some of our community members recovering from coronavirus. And Linda, if you have children, grandchildren, the Regents exams have been canceled. Wow. We know that right now. Yes, yeah, so they're going to be putting a plan forward if it moves beyond that, if there's something else these kids need to do. But we do know students are out of school until the end of April, pretty mm -hmm. much. So Regents exams now, candled, uh, now canceled. They did have a plan for the AP exams as well. Right. Those were moving to a different format. We knew that last week, but we did learn yesterday the Regents were canceled. Well, you know, that's interesting because we've had a lot of parents keeping their kids busy by saying, go study for the Regents. Yeah. Go study for the Regents. <laughs> yeah, right, exactly. Right? Yeah, yeah. So, you know, that's, that's the formal exam. So we'll have to wait and see if there's anything else that comes out of it. But again, we just don't know when school is even going to go back into session. Yeah. So that's going to be something that if you do have someone who was planning to take the Regents, keep your eye out and ears out for any more information on that. All right. Now, Katie, with all the news that we've been living with, we need a little levity. Yes. We need a little levity. Yeah. We need a sense of humor. And I got to tell you, people are getting very creative. And Shays Buffalo getting very creative. They're launching a Broadway song competition. All right. Okay. Listen to this just to get an idea. Shay's got this a great, this wonderful idea, and they're calling this the Shay's Broadway Video Challenge. So they want you to do the same thing. Watch this video for inspiration on YouTube. Pick your favorite Broadway song, make the lyrics new and relevant, record the video, and share it at Shay's Buffalo page. Ask friends to like your video, and winners will get a chance to win a Shay's swag bag. And all entries must be submitted by this Friday at 9 a.m. So what would we do, Katie? Hmm. I thought of this. I actually thought of this upstairs. Okay, here's the one I came up with. Re levity, everybody. Corona, there must be a cure for Corona <laughs> because I cannot stay at home another day with you. <laughs> oh, Linda, I like that What do you one. think, huh? <laughs> okay, wait, can I do one? Yes, yes. No, I cannot sing to save my life, so please, please. Levity. Do, tomorrow, tomorrow, <gasps> I'll hug you tomorrow. tomorrow. <laughs> See, that's what they're talking about. And of course, I know a million ideas are coming your way, so maybe there's something that you can kind of have fun with. And thank you, Shays, for that. Yeah. And again, all their information is on their webpage. All right. Very good. All right, so that's the way we're starting today's show. We'll get you thinking. We've got lots more coming up. Katie, we'll see you at the end of the program. Sounds good, Linda. We'll take a break and be right back.